the way Post Affiliate Pro 4 keeps track of what kind of commissions for each affiliate, um, it uses something called campaigns. And I'm going to click on campaigns here and click on overview. And you'll see that there's some basic statistics here. And I'm going to click on campaigns manager. And I have created two campaigns. Um, actually, one of them was um, by default in here already. And if you want to get rid of the default one or any other one, you can just check this box and click delete. It'll get rid of it. And if you want to add a campaign, click the Add Campaign button here. You want to give the campaign a name. Um, whatever you want to call it. You can actually upload an image. Click Change Image here to upload an image if you want your affiliates to see a graphic next to that. And then you've got a description here and there's a WYSIWYG editor you can use if you want um, for the description, but I'm just going to put 20% commissions and leave it at that. And I'll leave it as active. And the cookie, zero is lifetime. You can put something like 90 days, 30 days, and it'll make the cookie have that lifetime. Override previous cookies, you can say yes, no, or default. My default is yes, so I'm going to leave it at that. Or you can have it override in this particular campaign. And then product ID matching, I'll get into that in some more advanced tutorials. And when you're finished, you just click Create, and the campaign was successfully added. And now when I come back to Campaigns Manager, you can see that it's added here. Now I can go over here and click this Edit, and this is where you get into the details on the campaign. Here are the details that I added already, and then going to Commission Settings, um, right now the type on per click or per sale you can do it on both or just one or the other and I'm gonna make it per sale and click edit um, automatic approval or not for the sales I'm gonna say manual approval so I make sure the payment was made and the commission I want to be a percentage at 20 percent and I don't want to support multi-tier commission so I'm gonna click save and close and now that's set up for a 20% commission for that campaign. And you can come in and adjust every existing campaign going through the same way with editing details. As simple as that.